uh, Barks Pika. This is this. These two have played a ton of times in the past year. Every set's been like last game, um, and I think Fire has the set count at four and three. He's won four out of se four out of seven sets that they played. I think they played seven times. Um, yeah, he's gonna look through the history. Correct me if I'm wrong. But uh, so Fire's got the set advantage against Bark. It's pretty they close. They played though, at the right? salty. Yeah, they, yeah it's, it's like four three the, the second. Um, they played at the salty suite. It was Fire or Fire last year going up 2-0 in the count. Uh, Bark taking the next two to go to game five. Then game five was a, a three one stock lead for, for Fire last year. Bark brings it back down to last stock and Fire takes it. So uh, these guys have close sets every time. It was a lot of shit talking for Genesis. Uh, which is really great. Brought a lot of hype. Um, yeah, they're both they're pretty evenly matched players. Fire's always the wow. better in major tournaments, though. That up B escape was right on time. Ooh, Good. he gets the Barry to avoid yeah. the grab, and then he, that reverse forward air is something interesting. Maybe an up smash would have been. Well, he had a parry. He had a parry, and he jumps. Dash that. Oh no, an up smash from. Uh, oh, Bark. From sorry, Fire Blaster when Bark was landing on that top platform. Oh, great recovery. Oh, great DJC. That Nair's going to kill him, too. All right, fire up a stock. Hypersense. Pika back there could take this, but, you know, Yoshi's okay at Hypersense. Oh, uh, I think he lost the window up there. No, he's got it. Park doesn't play edge guard. He thought, he thought Park fire was dead. He, uh, he's still going to jump back here. Oh, and yeah, there. nice. Nice Nair. All right, we're dead even here. Up forward tilt. Dash tack, what does he do? What does he do? Down, up here, yeah. All right, fire, uh, fire up a stock, a clean full stock lead, strong man, strong man stock lead. Fire Blaster looking really good at this matchup. This is also a, a f game five set, or a five game set. Best of five, so. And Bark just kind of racking some damage, knowing Fire Blaster's too uh, low percent to break his super armor. Ooh! Goes for the double. I've seen uh, the double. <laughs> <laughs> We've actually seen a lot of uh, triple imitators, but none of them are stocks or anything. A lot of triple imitators. All right, we're even three stocks a piece here. For since we're really, really close. Oh, forward smash. I don't think Fire wanted a forward smash. But maybe he did. Oh, n nice late DJC. Lands that forward air to the up smash. Oh! Oh! Almost one gets more, it. One more down air hit with a broken shield. And he parries that up air. Good sweet spot by Bark. Yeah, Fire's Bark really doing a great job getting back. The Yoshi jabs are so good when Pika's on that ledge. Yeah, hide. same with like against Fox. A couple characters, those jabs are really deadly. So the back here breaks. All right, Bark up a stock, 100%. I mean, one touch by, by Yoshi takes that. Good parry or shield jump to get out of there. Ooh. Bark. Taking the jump a few, t uh, the double jump a few times. All right, Bark's got, Bark counts these percentages. Oh, That's nice. That's stock. Uh, Bark Push got, off up air. Bark got the forward air that got Yoshi over 76%. What Bark's going to try to do is just get fire off stage. He's going to edge hog and he's going to jump out back here. Fire needs to know that and not let this happen. So what, that percentage is 76? 76. Fresh back here. He's obviously, he'd rather forfeit the, the freshness of the back air um, to uh, to make sure he gets the, with the neutral. But now he's going to back here. Oh, he misses. Wow, he overcommits to it. I think Fire wanted the dash. Nice reverse there. bear. Fire knew he was probably dead there, so he did that forward air, hoping that he could, he could catch Bark with it. Uh, Bark knew that. He knew he had percentage or space to work with, so he let Fire miss the forward air and punish. That edge spike? Oh! Ooh, that, just also, unfortunate that to miss it, yeah. Oh, no. That's it. That'll do her. Huh. Adds a little Extra push back to there it, for yeah. Overkill. All right, Bark takes the first game, two stocks. He always got to win. That's true, that's true. What did he say? He said he always got to be thorough. Don't just assume the jump is gone. Oh, yeah. 
But yeah, yeah, I guess if it's there, you might as well. I was just worried about a forward yeah, air. Yeah, just losing But I guess it wasn't his last stop. It wasn't. You know? True, true, true. But a forward air, like if, if you well, think Well, let's assume he does have the, let's say Fireblaster does have the jump. And he and Fire does get the forward air off. Bark dies, Fireblaster gets back, and now it's the last stock in there. I just think the risk, he's talking about, you know, you just want to clean up and don't assume. I, I agree that maybe important. the risk isn't worth it. The risk the isn't worth it there. because you can just grab the ledge. Fire was at enough percent that you could have just back here. You could have gotten up and back here again. You had, you had a very safe edge guard against him if he did have his jump back. Um, it's just better than forfeiting your own stock. Oh, and he's, he likes to do that forward air and then just go for the ledge a lot, I've noticed. Oh, nice nair. Yeah, edge wow, back he needs him there with that back air. Yeah, he nicely. likes he likes edge hogging because then you can get the back air lower while still having while while in a rising position. While if you try to drop down and do the back air, the your your intersection point is a lot smaller because you, you're both moving in two opposite directions. Right, and you're falling, so after you land the, the hit or miss it, your recovery. Yeah, is you're in a position limited. where you're, you're recovering very low. It can get spiked like reverse spike. Oh, that's wild, a nice great out smash. Well, if you like ledge hog and jump up, your 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 intersection point lasts longer because you're both moving in the same direction. Forward air. Doesn't get it. This should be up. Oh, down B. Down B, yeah. There's just good options there. They can do up air, down B. It's uh, either it's one of them would have worked, free right? Free yeah. Stock. yeah. Low angled F tilt dash attack for the ledge. Go down B to avoid the, the edge guard. Ooh, Ooh, I don't think he wanted to. I think he wanted to pivot. F tilt or F tilt or, or even like pivot, just like up smash, because he wanted to just make peek a miss. So Bark's got this stock advantage here. Good nice. parry. Yeah, great parry. Bark came in with that. Oh, forward, tilt, forward yeah. air. Yeah, easy. All right, so fire, uh, fire ties it back up. Wow, yeah, great you, job if waiting. You're, if, you're, if you're forward airing his peak against Yoshi, uh, the second your forward air finishes, Yoshi always has the advantage to hit the hit. So you want to, good edge hog, uh, you want really to forward air, rack up some damage, but you don't want your forward air to finish while you're still in contact with Yoshi. You'll get like a free hit. Yeah, so you that's why we've seen Bark kind of like laying, falling away and landing at the uh, edge of the stage, yeah, like catching the ledge. Forward air, get, get some of the hits on, and then just... Make sure your forward air finishes when you're no longer in contact with Yoshi because it's going to set them off. They're they're waiting for that forward air to finish before they do their attack. So if you if you if you finish hitting them but the forward air is still going, you're going to trick that Yoshi into not doing their attack and you're not getting punished. Good, good, good. That's what you were talking about right speed, there. Yeah. Back here. Oh, Bark, stop styling. It's too risky. At 111 percent, you do that or whatever. You just Go for the safer option. You get free, you get free edge guard to that percentage. He jumps away from that up air. Oh, oh yeah, and that up it. tilt comes out a little early, so fire lands or fire blaster lands at forward air. It's confusing having fire blaster and fire yeah. when you go fire blaster fire. It's like we keep mixing up the names. Not, we don't we know which player is playing. It's just uh, it's a lot of fire scene. in the building. Yeah. Don't say that too loud. Wow, man! Uh, poor poor a fire. Huge flub. Poor fire. He, he he's. Done that a couple of times. How he lost the Kiro. Not, not necessarily how he lost the set the Kiro, but how he lost certain. We get a few LMAOs and LOLs from Star King, Boom, and Cobra. What are they laughing about? That last stock for oh. Fire Blaster. <laughs> <laughs> so bark up 2-0 here. Uh, those games have been pretty close. Even though that was like a three stock, that was. That's hard to call that a good three stock, considering like Fire just missed certain certain kills. Bark was at 180 um, percent. He was just a oh, great job by Fyro. It wow. didn't kill, though. Bark was able to up you out. Yeah, Bark with a great recovery there. Up smash. That's good. That won't do it either. Oh. Cool. Nice egg. Give him a facial. Give him two facials. Oh, I want to see triple facial. The locos huevos. Scrambled. <laughs> oh, wow. What? That DJC. He like DJ seemed like he like wavesy wave dash to land where he was the up tilt. And Pikachu won that up tilt battle. Oh, and breaks oh, the armor with the up grab, smash, but grab by fire. Wow, and fire blaster goes for that forward air. Oh, 
Oh, he, he read. Smart idea. He read yeah. his positioning. He was just off by a couple pixels. Bark really plays like a very efficient game. He really knows what he's trying to do. Oh, well, I mean, he's like he studied this matchup. He knows he's got like a tree built of every option he's got to do at every position and every percentage. Wow. Not literally. It's not like he's got it written down, but he he, he knows it in his oh. head. That's a nice drop it. through too from Bark. So Bark with a stock lead here, putting a fire blaster on his tournament uh, game. Good up there. Doesn't kill. Too low. If it was like a little above the platform, it would have. Not back here, will it? Yeah, that'll do it. So, Fire Blaster, if he's able to overcome this, so the mountain of Pikachu stocks to climb. Good parry. Yeah. Wow. The F tilt clanks, and then Pikachu's able to run in for the grab. Ooh, another one, and that should do it. it. Yeah. yeah. All right, so bark up a stock. Fire's got to start winning this this neutral, and then taking the touch and getting the stocks right away. He can't be missing any combos. Bark really showing that he knows his matchup. And so quickly to put on all that damage. And DJ, see down here, great back out's gonna take it. No! Oh. Man, I've been wrong about that a lot. Feel bad, stream. Oh, and that weak one won't do it. Good face. Scrambled. Good down oh, smash. Oh, yeah. The Good. down smash is nice. Covers uh, front and back. Yeah. There's that whole option there. Man, he's got to be careful. Good parry. Oh, tries that up tilt. Bark doing a nice job of Good maneuvering off. around it with that back air. Last stock for fire. Um, he's got a percentage on Pika that if he can, uh, it's gonna be tough. If he can get like a forward tilt near the edge, it's gonna be a stock. That's it. That's the jump, I think. Oh, Good. nice parry. Yeah, Bark sneaking in some up smashes. He loves it against Yoshi. It like basically beats the parry because tries the, the wizard. That's uh -oh. it. If, if he doesn't. He's got a hog ledge or something. There he goes. All right, Bark takes it 3-0. Wow. Bark decisively. Bark with the rematch against Kiro in Grand Finals. This will also be best of five. Bark really good at that matchup. Mm, pivot down B says Boom, yeah. He can do that just fine. Don't know why he isn't, but I think he's playing like shit personally. Okay, Kiro, please make this an eight-minute set. I'm tired. Who's that? Uh, Cobra. Uh, <laughs> Cobra wants us to go to, to, go to bed. Up tilt, DJ. Cobra, if you want to go to bed, you just go to bed.